fuck? <laughs> Literally shredded. <laughs> Whoa, look at that! Oh my god! Are you ready? Here we go. Five, four, yeah. Good morning, day three. We have survived a third night. We took our gear down. Hammocks are no longer suspended. I did lower the uh, zip line to a more natural uh, slack line. Got a little fire this morning, a little coffee. And uh, it's cool, the, the ocean covered with blankets of uh, of clouds and the clouds actually kind of crept up to us here we were enveloped in clouds for a little while but it looks almost like there's some kind of a something trying to break through there but you can see the cloud level is much higher than it was the other days which i don't know if that means it's going to break up or or what but uh what another gorgeous gorgeous day and brian said some uh large four-legged animal like a dog or a wolf or something came through camp kind of crept right, right along here might be able to see some paw prints and they quickly scared it off uh, yeah. Let's see yeah there's some paw prints around here i don't know if you can kind of see in the video looks like one there yeah there's a few more right over here quite a pretty oh, good yeah, size cool. pad Get a little, uh, do you ever do plaster casts? Yeah. Oh, yeah, cards? I do that. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> that would be awesome. A nice, nice little uh, walled fire pit we created last night. Cooked our food in there, worked out very well. But, uh, oh, nice. Yes, nice little wood pile. We took a little bit more off of that uh, uh, log over there across the street, across the way. But, um, yeah, no need for our tarps at all. Never got rainy. I uh, could actually, in your hammock, just look up and see a few stars through the cracks in the rocks. Just gorgeous. Anyway. All right, well, we'll catch you guys a little bit later. But uh, I want to say good morning. Day three. Yeah. That's the old picture of us are going. All right. I know, man. Yeah, thank you. <coughs> bug. bug. You need a bug now? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there it is. Inside my frickin' helmet. <laughs> <laughs> That just grossed me out. All right, so let's do this. You want to lead? You want me to lead? I'll lead. I'll lead. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, we are 
are leaving Pruitt Ridge to go back to civilization and back to work. Oh, it's freaking me out. I had that bug in my mouth. Alright, so we're gonna go right up to here. Ah, oh, the clouds are beautiful. They never lifted. So, let's make sure I'm recording. Alright, I was recording. Alright, Brian's behind me. Sweet. Okay, so we're going back down the five mile road. And I gotta remember when we get to that fork. We're gonna go left. All right. Now the bike is a lot lighter than it was before because I don't have all that water, Woo fuel, and food that I was carrying with me. So the bike just seems that's the one I was gonna go to. <laughs> oh well. Um, the bike just seems way more nimble, a lot less intimidating, and you feel like you have more control. God, wait, look at that. Bless America. Wow. You cool? Here we go. On down the hill. Yeah, that guy uh, pulled up this morning. We saw him driving past. Looked like he was a guy looking to go for a campsite. I said, hey. He's like, you're looking for a site? He's like, yeah. I'm like, we're like, we're about to leave. Oh, shoot. Okay. We're about to leave so you can have uh, our place. He's like, oh, dude, thank you so much. Thanks for talking. Thanks for giving me your spot. That's awesome. A beautiful place. So anyway, he was real grateful. We sat and shot, shot the talked for a while Whoa. and um, it's kind of cool he's just traveling around in his Prius so he made it up here in a flipping Prius I'm just impressed with that all these roads we could check out Ooh, actually I should pull over and tell Brian that whoa <laughs> hey, hello! <Hi>. Hey. <laughs> All these other side roads we haven't even explored. Right. So there's a lot of opportunities out here, I think. I was say, I, I, there's like definitely more trees. I'm like trying to get a quick look. Yeah. Yeah, we'll have to go. We'll definitely come back here again. Yeah. Okay. All right. <laughs> totally. All right, here we go. <laughs> He kind of came up awfully quick, didn't he? Yeah. <laughs> Hope I got that one on film. <laughs> oh. All right. All right, boy, this road is so much nicer coming back. Not that there's anything different in the road, but it's like riding with a passenger and then riding without a passenger. And in conditions like this, it's just when your bike is lighter, it's just easier to control. And more enjoyable. Whoa, whoa, shit. <laughs> okay, look out for those shadows. It can be a little confusing. Here's where we want to go. To the left. Okay, sweet. Going left. A bit of a jump. <laughs> okay, so. That was the turn that I confused myself last time when I was leaving. I wasn't sure which way to go. One way would be back to civilization. The other way to no man's land. Just deeper into the unknown where you could get, not lost, well I could get lost, but the main thing would be running out of fuel, which is not good. So I topped off my tank with uh, one gallon and that extra liter. Ooh, what we got here? Pick a good line and go for it. Right, light and shadows can be a little tricky there. Alright, we gotta, gotta watch out for traffic coming because that could really be a bummer if a car came running around the road. Alright, 20 bow totally 
trails riding doing this. <laughs> well, that's awesome. I should try to get some shots of, of him. I'm thinking. You want to lead a little bit and I'll get you on film? All right, you feel good? Yeah, I'm good with that. Okay, cool. Yeah, we just pulled off the road. Just check out a nice view. As we go to this nice little canyon. The road was taking us, whoops, kind of down here, down there. And we noticed a little uh, roof house thing. Right. There, I think. So I don't know what the heck that is. But look at this view. It's like looking out of the wing of an airplane. Mm -hmm. You know? Oh, you see that. Completely. 